much as we get on here and we talk about Mike McCarthy's job, I, I defended Mike McCarthy uh, a couple weeks ago when we were talking, is he going to be fired if you go to Tampa? Bruh, Mike McCarthy has been to the playoffs twice in three years of coaching. All right, he won a playoff game this year. His quarterback turned the football over. He can't control that. That's Kellen Moore and Dak Prescott. I have been saying it for two months. Two months I've been sitting here saying, hey, man, Kellen Moore and Dak Prescott are the most important people to if Dallas can win anything. I still didn't think they were going to win a Super Bowl. I mm -hmm. didn't think that they would beat, beat Philly in a playoff game fully healthy. But ultimately, we come, we, we keep talking about this man's job, man. Like, at, so who are you going to get? All right, let's just say you get Sean Payton. Wow. You still don't have the roster. The roster. Howie Roseman went out and traded for A.J. Brown. We just finished talking about Philly and their offensive line and how it was put together. This team was better suited to win a Super Bowl when Dak was a rookie than they are right now. And the coach is still having some success. We're getting them to at least to the playoffs in the tournament to have a chance at getting there. I Look, I don't mind bearing a coach, okay? Don't, don't mind it at all when I think he needs that type of vitriol and energy. We keep talking about Mike McCarthy. I've been in this organization. I'm telling y'all, Kellen Moore is that guy in waiting like Jason Garrett was when he was in waiting, controlling what they do offensively. Boy wonder is what hmm. they tagged him. Now, mm -hmm. we can talk about that turnovers, and that's rightfully so, but we need to have the same type of energy going towards Kellen Moore as well. Do y'all think it's a coincidence? I'm going to give y'all another example. Do y'all think it's a coincidence that Josh Allen potentially struggled under Ken Dorsey after Brian Dayball left? Yeah. That's how important an offensive coordinator is. You want the truth? You can't handle the truth.